a lot of time talking about two services. Okay? We spent a, quite a bit of time. I went back through all those videos, I remember. We talked about workstation service. What is that? Workstation service is a key component, listen carefully, of a Windows ecosystem. It's a Windows service owned, copyrighted by Microsoft. It is a service that allows you to look out in the network and see what? Service. Service. That's right. Any PC that has this service turned on, any Windows PC, and listen carefully, do PCs have <laughs> server service turned on? It's very common that they do. In fact, every one of these computers yes. out here have this service on. Immediately when I say server, you're thinking, HP, Dell, IBM Blades, big pieces of hardware. I'm not. I'm talking about a what? Software package. Let, let me go back. Workstation service is a software that is running on 99% of all your PCs. On tablets, it is rarely running on a phone, but is running on uh, Windows tablets, running on your PCs, and the workstation service allows you to go out in the network and see anybody who has what running. How do you do that? It's like on by default when you get a computer, right? It is on by default. So when you install Windows at home, guess what? Workstation service is automatically installed and turned on. And believe it or not, server service is automatically installed and turned on. This is why Every PC that Microsoft produces has a firewall because server service makes you visible to the network. And to protect you from malicious people, they put a firewall so only authorized people can get into your PC. Because the minute I turn on this service, you can be seen on the network. It is the service, listen carefully, it is the service that allows all those nice big HP servers back there to make files and folders available, that makes printers available on the network. That is the service that allows us to share, to be visible to the network. You do not have to share folders and files with server service on, but you will, when it is running, be visible. So what is the difference between server and workstation? Very good. See how complicated this is? Workstation is the software that allows you to go out in the network and see any PC that has what service on? Server. That's server. it. Look, look at me. Workstation software does not allow you to see a Mac. If you, if, unless the Mac has a Samba service running, yeah. unless a Mac has Samba server service running on that Mac, folks, you will not see a Mac on the network. If I put Ubuntu and do not turn on their Samba server service, you will never see a Linux box. They will be like, they don't exist on your network. Now, does Linux want to be able to see Windows PCs and do Linux boxes often want to share folders and files to Windows PCs? Yes. Then they must install Samba, Samba Workstation and Server on their Linux boxes in order to be visible. This is a Windows ecosystem only. If I take all these PCs and take them off the network and I put Linux boxes on, Linux will see Linux boxes. And they don't have to have a Samba service running. They can put, uh, they, they can use different services. They use a different way of sharing files that have nothing to do with Samba. And if we put Linux machines in, they'll all see Linux. They'll see each other. They'll be able to share files. They'll be able to transfer files, do everything that the Windows ecosystem. But since Windows is a predominant operating system everywhere, yes? Yes. Probably everywhere except China. Yeah. <laughs> they, they love Linux. Yeah. So everywhere but say China, they all try to play in the Windows ecosystem. Macs do, Linux boxes do, and in order for them to play, 
in the Windows ecosystem, what must they have running? They have to have Samba workstation and they must have Samba server. Does that make sense? Listen to me carefully. Listen carefully. She can't see servers. She can't share. True? Can she launch her Chrome browser and get to the internet? Yes. yes. Why? The, the answer is yes, she can. It doesn't have anything to do with Workstation. Things. Thank you, Kirsten. Remember, Workstation and Server is about seeing PCs and, and sharing folders and files. It has nothing to do about going to the internet. internet. So even though I turn off her Workstation, I turn off her server, now I can sleep when she's at work, I can rest that she's not doing destructive things, but when she launches her Chrome browser, she still can go to the internet because that browser doesn't use workstation or server services.